Hello there. I'm Carlos, and this is Kingdoms, where all your nerdy dreams come true. Today's episode is a special one for us because we were able to set up all of our gear and record at our local game store, Game Grid in Lehigh, Utah. In this game, we are joined by the owner, Jordan, and one of the store managers, Brock. I know not everyone is lucky enough to have a good local game store or even an LGS period nearby, and that's one of the reasons we feel so lucky to be able to share this with you today. Having said that, this has been a hard couple of years for local game stores, and I'm super happy that we still have Game Grid around. We just started a small partnership with them where when you buy from their website using our link, we get a portion of the sale to help build our channel and you are directly supporting an amazing LGS too. So check out our link in the description and let us know down in the comments if you buy from them. And as always, one of the best ways to support us is to like this video and subscribe to our channel. With that, let's check out our commanders and starting hands for today's game. First we have Jordan, the owner of Game Grid, playing Galea Kindler of Hope. His starting hand includes a plains, an island, a forest, ethereal armor, life from the loam, three visits, and courser of crucifix. Second we have Brock, who's a manager at Game Grid, playing Sliver Legion. His starting hand includes a Forest, Ancient Ziggurat, Savai Triome, Amoeboid Changeling, Manaweft Sliver, Reflex Sliver, and Sliver Queen. Third, we have Carlos with Kingdoms playing Feather the Redeemed. His starting hand includes a Plains, Forbidden Watchtower, Get to Encampment, Sacred Foundry, Slayer Stronghold, Loyal Apprentice, and Acrobatic Maneuver. Fourth, we have Dylan with Kingdoms playing Killian Ink Duelist. His starting hand includes a Plains, Cave of Koilos, Myriad Landscape, Giant Killer, Dam, Spirit Loop, and Price of Fame. All right, let's play some magic. Hello, I'm Jordan, I own Game Grid. We've been around for like a decade and we are the second biggest store in Utah. Oh, choose it, there we go. Okay, now we do it. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, I'm second. First. I'm, I'm cool with this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's um, not bad. You're first, so right. take us away. Untap, upkeep, draw, and then I will play a forest. Did you draw? Oh yeah, I got to draw. You <laughs> said it. Is that your turn? Yeah, that's it. Kay. Go ahead. I will draw as well. I'll play a Savai Triome tapped. Nice. And then pass my turn. Okay, draw for turn. I will play a Sacred Foundry tapped and uh, pass turn. Okay. And tap up, keep draw. I will play a Silver Quill Campus uh, tapped. Just for flavor. On theme, yeah. On theme. <laughs> uh, go ahead. Untap up, keep draw. We'll pop down a plains and then we'll cast three visits. Nice. Let's go get a card. Very nice. And say go. Okay. That can get any oh, wait, wait. any get forest. Any forest right? So it can be a dual land, yeah. Oh man, yeah. never mind. Then I'm gonna play a sentinel. Dude. You will you'll have to shock it in though. But there's shocks in here? Okay. Shocking in that and we're gonna play a... Uh, Un unthematically, yeah. we'll play Esper Sentinel in my next yeah. deck. Sentinel. Going counter theme here. <laughs> Go ahead. Is it two? All right. Uh, yeah, two. Yep, I will you. untap and draw. I will play a Rejuvenating Springs untapped because I have three opponents. <laughs> nice. And then I'll pay two for Mana Weft Sliver. And then I'll pass my turn. Already starting. Who's got the board wipe? <laughs> I know. <laughs> I get out of hand. <clears throat> draw for turn. I will play a Plains land for turn. I'm going to play a Loyal Apprentice. It's a 2 1 with haste. Um, if I have my commander out um, at the beginning of combat, I get a 1 1 Thopter with haste. Don't currently have Feather. So I will. Uh, Brock, I'll tag you for two. All right. I will take the two. Come on. Look at that trade. <laughs> no way. <laughs> I'll pass the turn. Okay. Untap. Draw. And then I will just play my planes and I'll tap for Killian. Whoa. Killian's got lifelink, menace, and uh, spells that I cast that target a creature cost two less to cast. And then I'll just pass. All right, untap, upkeep, and drop. Then pop down a Courser of Crucifix. Top card revealed. 
I can play lands off the top, and then when lands enter play, play an island, I gain a life. And then I will also attack Brock for one. <laughs> take that sliver. Take the one yet trade. again. <laughs> And that's everything for me. Go ahead. Okay. So I will untap. Nothing on upkeep. And I'll draw. I will play an Ancient Ziggurat. That's the one that's just creatures? Correct. Okay. Yes. It's a color creature. It creatures. is bad uh, Cavern of Souls. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pay one with Rejuvenating Springs to play Soul Ring. Uh, did you want to pay the tax? Yeah, first yeah. non creature yeah. spell yeah. each uh -huh. turn. You gotta you pay, pay one. one. Or, yeah, I'll pay my taxes. <laughs> I'll pay it. I'm happy to counter your soul ring. No, no, I'll pay <laughs> You should have done the trade! <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll pay one, two, three, four for reflex sliver. Ooh. Gives all my slivers haste. Oh, man. Oh, it's go. getting gross already. Well, everyone's slivers, actually, if any of you are running slivers for some reason. Hey. <laughs> And Pocket. then I'll pass my turn. Full of change lines over Okay, <laughs> draw for turn. Oh, all right, Brock. You want to trade this time too? <laughs> um, not particularly. All right. <laughs> I will then play Tillonali's Summoner. It's a one-one with the send that I can pay mana to get red elemental creatures, and they die if I don't have the city's blessing at the end of turn. They stay around if I do. Um, I'll then play a. Forbidding Watchtower is land for turn tapped, and I'll pass the turn. All right, I'm gonna untap, draw. I'm gonna play Caves of Koilos, and I am gonna or take one damage and get two black. I'm gonna cast Inner Demon onto Killian. Oh, enchanted yeah. creature or enchanted creature. Enchanted creature gets a plus two plus two, has flying and is a demon and is a demon. When it enters the battlefield, all non-demon creatures get minus two, minus two until the end of turn. <laughs> oh. I don't I don't love that. <laughs> oh, you the board you guys me. were asking for, right? Oh. Did you want to pay the tax? <laughs> <laughs> no, you can have it. No? You, you can draw Wait, it. I don't you draw a card, right? Oh I draw a card. Yeah. That's all it does? I thought it countered spells. What a lame <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Alright, now it's dead. So that will be a enchanted. And then I'm also gonna cast Spirit Loop, enchanting Killian for one. Ooh. Uh it it is like double life link essentially. Yeah. It's like kind wow. of like before it was keyworded, but it also like fogged your opponent's creatures back then, right? Uh, and then so Carlos, good. I'm gonna come at you. Whoa! You have not taken damage. And and Feather's a bully. <laughs> feather is a bully. <laughs> this is a fair Feather deck. How much damage? Okay, so he's a two-two, and then he gets plus two. So yeah, so four. And then I'll gain eight. Yeah. Wow. See, this oh, because he has regular life link. Oh wow. Uh, That's why you always shock your lands in, <laughs> like deceptively yeah. Yeah. damage. <laughs> Yeah, I I am uh, <laughs> the slowest right now, you know. Yeah. Uh, well. All right, all right. We're gonna cast Nature's Lore to search for a forest card and put it onto the battlefield. Ooh. Not tapped. That's not a. Ah! <laughs> so many. All right, I'm writing notes. All right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, and then. Uh, Following my own advice, we're finding a breeding pool so that I can keep shocking myself out of competition. <laughs> uh, so you don't take the commander take damage. Exactly. <laughs> keep people from receiving incorrectly. Hey, I still got attacks. <laughs> well, that's because your slivers, though. Yeah, <laughs> that, yeah. that's <laughs> fair. Right? So you could shock yourself to death. And you yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, man. All right. And then, of course, there's going to. Reveal a land. Yeah, I called nice. it. Oh, and again, a life for the shock and a life for the island. That is really good tech in that deck. Ah, oh, cross and verge. So, All right, we're getting we're getting mean. I'm gonna put ancestral mask on my courser. Mm -hmm. You've got two enchantments, and that's each other enchantment on the battlefield. Oh, so, shoot. Nice. and he's wow. an enchantment. So yep. plus six plus six. He's an eight ten. And Sick. an ethereal armor. Yeah. So it's each enchantment I control, so just three more. So that's 11. That's and uh, attacking high power over here. Dylan. Uh, exactly. For how oh. uh, 11. Yep. Boom. Right? Two plus six is eight. Oh, wait. I lied. Two more for the ethereal armor. So 13. Wow. Woo! Wow. Heck of a turn. <laughs> 
Wow. All I'm right. glad that's not your command. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I always forget about command damage, and then it's yeah. just like, oh, whoops, I'm dead. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right, you're up. And up. then, all right, I will untap, upkeep, and draw. I will play my land for turn first in a forest. I'll pay for Bone Scythe Sliver, mm. which is double strike. Mm -hmm. D -d -d double strike. And then I will pay two more for Amoeboid Changeling. <laughs> oh, nice. Mm. I can make your stuff slivers or my stuff not slivers for some reason if oh, I wanted to. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> and then I will pass my turn. Yeah. Huh. I'll draw for turn. Yeah, I guess I'll play a, a mountain. I'm going to play Tethmos High Priest. As heroic, whenever I cast a spell that targets this guy, I can return a creature card with Converted Mana Cost 2 or less from my graveyard to the battlefield. I'll pass turn. Okay, I will untap, draw. I need some cantrip or something. Yeah, I feel really guilty. Like, you lent me a much better deck than you're playing. <laughs> no, Wait, this is... Planes? No, no. No, that one is probably a tiny bit better, but I love this deck. I think they're on par. Oh, yeah, I'm playing the Myriad Landscape instead of the Plains. And I'm going to play... Nice. Like oh, Shielded by Faith. Shielded by Faith. Indestructible? Give it Indestructible. What else does it do? Uh, and then whenever a creature enters the battlefield, I may attach uh, it oh. to that creature. Uh, uh -huh. All those other creatures you're going to be playing, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then I will also... I will go... You don't want it. You don't want it. <laughs> you don't want it. I thought it was a me, but uh, yeah, you're gaining life back. I'll come in. I'll come back at you. All right, so I'm taking uh, so still eight, just right? four, and you're gaining eight. That's not. So it is two, four. Yep, and then I'll gain eight. There we go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, so and then four damage on you. You guys oh, are yeah, both like on this oh, weird man. dance of life, right? Yeah. <laughs> just gotta find a way to play more land. Yeah. <laughs> Forcer to pump me up. All right, draw, reveal. No. Play that tapped. Gain a life from my Corsair. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Should have played the Crescent Verge so I could shuffle some stuff away. We're actually just going to take this opportunity. Mm -hmm. I just want to cast my commander and keep some colors open. There you <laughs> go. There we go. Boom. Get this silly card out. I can look at the top card of my library anytime. Wow. <laughs> so impressive. Woo. And cast R and equipment spells from the top. And if I cast an equipment spell that way, enters the battlefield, I can attach it. Ooh, so spicy. That's why there's like the big huge hammer. What's that mm -hmm. hammer? Yeah. A colossal, colossal hammer. hammer. And I also like uh, it's over on the wall. I was gonna say, did yeah. you see the life size one we've got? Yeah, on the wall? it's on the wall. Oh, where? It okay. is literally yeah. like the size of your torso oh, for just the hammerhead. There's it's also huge. Cauldra Complete and like all these ones wow. that ta cost so much to equip. But there you go. Now, so. Okay, that's coming right back at you. Okay, I will respond. Oh no! And I should have gone somewhere else. For mana, I'll, I'll uh, cast Chop Down. Oh! Uh, uh, target creature, power four or greater. Uh, and crush! It will, and it will go on an adventure. All right, hide my fabled passage from view. <laughs> you can still look at it though. <laughs> like look whenever I want. Yeah. Yes. And that's it. That's your turn. Yep, that's the turn. Go All ahead. right. So my turn. I will untap. Upkeep. I will draw. I'm gonna pay six to cast Constricting Sliver. Ooh. So exactly. sliver creatures I control have, when this creature enters the battlefield, you may exile target creature and opponent controls until this creature leaves the battlefield. Holy crap. Can Ooh. I see that? You're going to yeah, put them back absolutely. in the command zone? Or are oh, you going to... Yeah, I think I do. It was an uncommon. Because you killed the really sliver. Also <laughs> wow. Fall They're down. like, yeah, this is fine. <laughs> I never saw that one. That's cool. Yeah, it's nuts. Yeah. Um, I'm going to attach Shielded by Faith to you. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever a creature enters. And wow. then uh, Spirit oh, fantastic. Move, to the graveyard from play, return it to my hand. Okay. Holy so that cow. will go to the graveyard. So I'll only lose that one, really, I guess. There we go. And then that will go to the command zone. <laughs> awesome. And Maybe. then I will pass my turn Bruh. without attacking. Draw for turn. That's cool. So you essentially saved your Shielded by Faith. 
fate it's a good until idea. Fillion's back around. Mm. Nice. Yeah. It's, it's a like, really hey, good you idea. You can borrow this. I guess. Maybe I'll put it on something else less threatening. <laughs> <laughs> you can put it on Feather for me if you like. Oh. <laughs> That's not less Dude. threatening. No. Dude. <laughs> it's no, only a 3-4. No, thank you. I mean, as we learned, it doesn't make it hexproof, so Brock <laughs> yeah. can just eat it yeah. with his next yep. sliver. It's and true. I will play Gitsu Encampment. I got both of them. The two <laughs> weirdo ones. Yeah, tap lands. Get yeah, there. I'll pass the turn. Okay, I'll untap, draw. I'll cast my giant killer. Uh, and I'll get my enchantment back. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Indestructible tapper. Oh, and, and then I'll get rid of, I'll try to get rid of that sliver. <laughs> wait, okay. wait, 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 what? You played, you destroyed his thing and you paid three mana for it. Is that right? I paid one mana for it. No, no, no. You had Killian out. Killian out. It costs two. Or it costs one, sorry. Yeah, because it reduces it by two. Yeah. If it targets something. Anything? Any yeah. creature. Yeah. yeah, Killian's really good. And then I'll attempt to damn. Overload? Overload. Overload. Come on. <laughs> wow. What are you doing? Is this your second I'm out board wipe? I'm sorry. Turn like six? <laughs> well, I mean, the other one was just minus two, minus two. It's, it's like, fair. it's your guys' fault for having garbage <laughs> creatures. Uh, well, I'm <laughs> there. It was second <laughs> turn. Before that happens, I'm going to turn bone size sliver into all creature types. Uh, uh, that's yeah, my yeah, turn. Uh, I'll pass. See, and that was exactly why I put my commander out. I was like, oh, yeah, man. Coffer's looking to yeah, light. Gotta I pay almost, some taxes. Uh, I shouldn't have played Feather either. Uh, I had some, yeah. Um, so we're gonna. I was thinking you were gonna target, but I guess you get it back if you have feather out. You're targeting thing, right? Uh, I only have one mana. I don't have any cheap ones right now. Uh, we're just recasting my oh. commander. Nice. Uh, oh, sorry. Untap up, keep draw. Recast, play my fabled passage that we all knew <laughs> was on top of my deck. Then play my commander. Look at the top card of my library. No the first secret in a long time. <laughs> and it's garbage, so we're cracking a fabled passage. <laughs> That's pretty good, though. And to be able to... We're gonna okay, be... I get. Okay, that makes sense. Why you have the the, fe the, the fetches? Oh yeah, to yeah. Cycle your. Anytime you can look at the deck. top of your deck, right? We're looking for a basic. And Carlos has decked this all out with too many non-basics, man. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> then we're gonna shuffle up. I'm gonna let everyone in on the secret. It was a far seek. Ah. Yeah, nothing but land. Nah. <laughs> There's a secret farce. tech in that deck that I feel like I've done that I haven't seen other people do. Oh, right. interesting. We'll you were so end. close to saying it. I was. <laughs> <laughs> but I, it could give first. away like uh, some strategy. So Okay, and then we'll look at the top or again. What a, well, yeah. it would hurt him, I think. Okay. So. That's it. All right, my turn. Yeah. Okay. I will untap and... Draw. Secret tech to the deck. Now I'm going to be thinking the whole rest of the game. What's the secret it's not that I'm like missing? crazy, like, but I, yeah, you'll you'll maybe get it when you see it. I'm going to pay uh -oh. three for spiteful sliver. Ooh. <laughs> I think I do. Yep. It's a great I time to be spiteful. It's flavor. Yeah. 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 So <laughs> whenever it's dealt damage, it deals that much damage. Well, whenever a sliver um, I control is dealt damage, deals that much damage to target player or planeswalker. Pretty strong. Nice. Yeah, that's good. And then I'll pay three for Scuttling Sliver. So my slivers have uh, pay two to untap it. Oh, Ooh. that's good too. That's a heck of a combo. I'm <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Am I missing something? <laughs> that is yeah, you just card. ended the game. <laughs> I'll pass my turn after that. All right. I got my man lands here ready to take everybody out. <laughs> for three total damage. <laughs> Draw for turn. Oh, gee, man, land. So good. We'll just uh, slam a Balefire Liege. That's a 2-4. Gives my red creatures plus one plus one. My white creatures mm. plus one plus one. When I play a red spell, it deals three damage to a player. When I play a white spell, I gain three life. Hmm. Woo! Nice. Okay. Just, uh, just a nice little pumper there for my little oh, token oh, creatures. Board wipe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, if you I want, I'll trade that for those guys. But <laughs> yeah, that's I'll, fair. That's I'll air Mesa, and I'll be done after. I don't that. think it would be nice if I did though. Yeah. <laughs> I will untap, upkeep, draw. Okay. Uh, I will get out Killian. Oh no. And move Shielded by Faith over to it. Ooh. All right. In response, I weep. <laughs> <laughs> I will also cast uh, Spirit Loop on to Killian. 
And I will pass. Draw. Look at the top card. Still not an enchantment. Cry some more. <laughs> um, so we're going to play Ramanap Excavator so we can play our fabled passage from the yard so we can fetch and find an enchantment to cast from the top of our library. <laughs> yeah, that's why that Ramanap's <laughs> there. there. Go. Is that the secret tech? No. Ah. That is a very good tech, though. That's very good synergy, though. Nope, you're good. Nah. All right. If it's the same card, I'm going to be sad. <gasps> yes. Perfect. I can cast Auras, mm -hmm. and I have the colors to do it, despite tapping like crazy for that excavator. <laughs> um, we're going to enchant Killian. Can't attack or block. Oh. So no. That Is was... that also have the same claws? So I can you could move it around, around too, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> there we go. Somebody play something better than a yep. Killian. <laughs> That's why I love that yeah. one. All right, so I guess. There's Vigilance. Oh, so I can just swing at things that can't block. <laughs> Take that, Dylan. We're coming at you. Four. four. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Untap. Upkeep and draw, please. Uh, this might get me somewhere. Yeah. I'll play a Vault of Champions, and then I will play... I'm going to put out the Legion so we can give you some command oh. attacks. Sliver Queen. Oh, there oh, she is. Oh, it's a real Sliver Queen? Yeah. I yeah. didn't even know there was one in the store. I bought it and here. Now there's two. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Wow. That's okay. sweet. You know, you want to move a... Uh, if you move Prison <laughs> Term, I won't attack you with Killian. Uh, but, oh, it's activated abilities on Prison Term? Uh, I don't think it's activated. I think so, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, and oh, it's activated yeah. abilities can't yep, be yep. played. Pop that okay. over. Well, <laughs> in response to that, I'll make a sliver. You got it. That's fine. <laughs> got it. I am sad about it now. <laughs> <laughs> and I will choose not to give yours indestructible. I mean, it'd be funny. <laughs> it, it would be funny. It would. All right, and it's just a 1-1, one, one, I believe. Yep. Oh, uh, even the fancy relic tokens? Ooh. All decked out. That's Heck sweet. Heck yeah. And then I will pass my turn. Back when slivers looked like slivers. <laughs> yeah. And I am so envious of that Shadow Morph foil, though. I love Lorwyn and Shadow Morph oh, yeah, block foils. Yeah, that one's super cool. They did a great job. Yeah. I'll draw for turn. I'll play Slayer's Stronghold as land for turn. Ugh, I guess so. This is really all I got right now. All right, I will play Feather. It triggers Balefire Liege twice. And I will do, let's see, you're at the highest life. I'll do three damage to you, uh, Dylan, and I'll gain three life. And I will be done because, yeah, I'm going to just pass. Okay, I'll untap and draw, play a planes. How big are your creatures then? Why would you worry about my creatures? I have the worst right. creatures out right now. <laughs> well, I attack. <laughs> Mine aren't great. Out who I'm I have a blink here. card. So. <laughs> <laughs> he has a 2-2 two -two and a 2-2. Two -two. Yeah, a 1-1. One -one. <laughs> Don't forget the 1-1. One -one. And a 1-1. One -one. Oh, yeah. One -one. Could have got him. Yeah. Team blocked that Killian. <laughs> <laughs> Brock, I will attack you, actually. How much uh, damage? It's 2. Oh, yeah. You sorry. I don't, have, I don't have a, bu yeah. a buff anymore, so it's 2. Oh. So I'll block, block with Scuttling Sliver and my Sliver token. And, and Scuttling Sliver is a what? It's a 2-2 two, two and a 1-1. One, one. So then I'll assign the damage to the Scuttling Sliver. Okay. And then Killing I'll gain that. 4. And then I also deal damage to you from Spiteful Sliver, <laughs> <laughs> equal to however much you did to them. Uh, so, so 2. two. Yep. Okay. <laughs> well, just take 2, man. <laughs> or I could deal damage to his face, and it would not be funny. Worth it, not worth the card. <laughs> Uh, I'm just going to cast Robe of Stars. Oh. What the heck does that do? Uh, it, so I have to equip for one. Equip creature gets a plus zero, plus three, and then I can pay two. If it's equipped, pay two mana. Uh, equip creature phases out. I and think then, it's funky how they're okay with phasing now again. Yeah. Well, I oh. think they figured out how to like, template it for Teferi's protection so it yeah. can open Pandora's box. Right? Yeah, that's true. All right. Untap all these gorgeous lands. Draw. And then let's take a peek. What do we got? Oh, I did not shuffle well enough. It's the same <laughs> thing. Use the Ramanap Excavator to play my Fable Passage. Go find some kind of basic land in here. And then let's give this whole pile of shuffles so we can get rid of that stupid sorcery. Just mucking up my game plan. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Far sick. <laughs> Let's take another peek. Well, it's not a sorcery. Um, so then we will go ahead and, in the lamest possible way for this deck, we're going to put an Argentum armor into play. Okay, um, Noble Hierarch, since we're going to be attacking alone, <laughs> pass the turn. You have Vigil, oh, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You keep reminding me and I keep forgetting. And we're going to go... Oh, we can't attack you. you got a big old feather over there. Um, <laughs> so we're going to pop over here at Dylan again. Yeah, and it's four? Yep. I'm already One, two, three, four. I've been hit <laughs> twice by it. You have, yeah. Kay. Two commander right. blows. Eight. All right, and then my turn. Yep. Okay. So I will untap, upkeep, and top deck something amazing. Or that. <laughs> That's also a thing I could top deck. I'll pay white, blue, black, red, green in the same manner I did for Sliver Queen to cast Sliver Legion. Ooh, plus one, plus one, preach. Sliver? Yes. All slivers? Yes. <laughs> on the battlefield. <laughs> and then, let's see, my slivers are currently plus four, plus four. Plus three, plus three. Plus other. three, plus each other, you're right. Plus three, plus three. I'll swing at you with a five, five, spiteful sliver, and you guys are making it hard to attack you. <laughs> right, four, four, at Jordan as okay, well. Okay, fine. So no. I've got how much coming my way? It's a five, five. It's a five, it Five. is my spiteful sliver. Okay. One, two, three, four. All good things must come to an end. And then I will pass my turn. Pass and turn. <clears throat> so is this the turn? Untapped, all the mana, feather's still alive. <laughs> Carlos just gonna <laughs> one shot. Thing. I'm gonna have one thing that I can. Is it a defiant strike? Draw oh, a card I, like, just I got one like cantrip thing, yeah. finally, that I can do. Oh, well, let me draw for turn. Um, hoping to distract Battlefield you from Forge. That. Yeah. <laughs> um, I do got this cool soul ring that I just drew. It's only... Ooh. I'm only happy about it because it's pretty. Wow. They look really good. It's from that secret layer. The black, the is, black magic. is magic one. I'll attack with feather. It's a 5-6. I will send it. I'm afraid of slivers. Even though I'm going to get a crack black back on this, I'm sure. I'll send 5 commander damage your way. I guess I'll take the 5 because I can't block flyers. And then I will second main pay 2... Three and four, and cast Seize the Day on Feather. Wow. Nice. Okay. So untap target creature and take an it. extra combat? Yeah. yeah. Mm. It'll trigger Feather because I target the creature. At the so end of your turn, you get it come back. back at the end of turn, yep. I think I don't attack, though. I think I pay, <laughs> I think I pay four mana to untap it. <laughs> because. Vigilance never costs so good. <laughs> yeah, it's just so sad, but. There's this, like, one mana enchantment from Kamigawa oh, that do, gives Vigilance. I knew there was something want. else. Oh. oh okay. I do three damage to you as well. Okay. There's eight damage. That's That was, I think, better overall, so. Five end of turn, uh, Seize the Day will come back, and I'll be done. Okay. Uh, I will crack Myriad, and I get. Two basic lands that shared land types, so let's get two. Uh, I was wondering why you swamps. weren't cracking or tapping things down with your giant killer. Yeah. I was like, what's, what's <laughs> the mana? What's he going to do? It's so sneaky. <laughs> just a myriad lands. Just a myriad yeah. lands. <laughs> okay, I'll untap. I'll keep draw. Okay, I am going to equip my ink, Killian Ink Duelist with the Robe of Stars. Ooh. Now it's two to phase. Extra <laughs> protection. <laughs> well, I guess I could get this out. It's a little protection. Um, Agent of Fates. Oh, no. Uh, it's a 3-2 death touch. Uh, but then whenever I cast a spell that targets it, it's got heroic. Uh, whenever I target it with a spell, uh, each opponent sacrifices a creature. Oh, oh. no. Wow. Like. Uh, pa I I'll pass. All right. Oh, untap. Yeah. Upkeep. We're gonna peek at the card, then we're gonna draw it for the turn. Uh, and then we're gonna <laughs> look at the next card. Oh man, <laughs> my hand's gonna be full of land because I just keep playing this fabled passage <laughs> so I can get rid of the top. <laughs> go excavator, go mighty mighty excavator. Don't you have to you get your land first? first. Oh man, <laughs> <Fell the pines. laughs> I was just like, uh. Wow. He's, he's not doing it for the land, yeah. that's why. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, it's sort of true. Why yeah. not I get yeah, all the shuffle, shuffle is the thing that matters, yeah. Pop this on this. Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. We got nice. a 10 10 vigilance. <laughs> oh. And when it attacks alone? Is no, it? just whenever it attacks, I destroy target permanent. 
We're gonna swing at Feather. Oh, uh, what? But triggering when we attack, uh, we're gonna target the agent of fate. The agent? All right. I'm okay with that. Yeah. I think that's <laughs> the thing I'm most scared of right now. Is no trample. Not having a board on my you, next turn. You could yeah. get rid of prison term. <laughs> it's always or, an option. Or, yeah, or <laughs> sliver legion. Yeah, there's uh, no trample. Or, it's just or, a, or, it's or prison just term. a ten ten. <laughs> um, I will block oh. with the. Don't do it. Just take the ten. The liege, like I think. Champ. Oh, right. with the leaves. Yeah, and, and then give it protection. I will oh, okay. for damage, I'll acrobatic maneuver it. What's that do? So it blinks it. Oh, man. And then I draw a card. What? Yeah. Blinking and drawing? It's three mana. Oh, okay. Um, well, that's totally fair, then. And yeah. Then that <laughs> still comes back at the end step, or is and it just that, target it'll come feather? Back, yeah. Any, any of my creatures Woo! with feather, yeah. Mm. All right. Well, that was my cool um, thing. And it comes right, this comes right back. Okay. This the this comes back at the end of turn. And you trigger, I, right? You gain three. When you cast it. Oh, I gain three. Spell. You're right. Yeah, because right. he's yeah. not gone yeah. when you cast yeah, that's it. that's true. There we go. Well, that was it. That's all the cool stuff I had. Go ahead. Okay. So I will do my beginning phase stuff and draw. I'll pay one red for striking sliver for oh, strike. No, Ooh. I should have blown Ooh. up a sliver. <laughs> Very nice. I disagree. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm going to attack, believe it or not. I'm going to no, attack. Plus four, plus four now? Yeah, I believe it. Yes, plus four, plus four. Um, I'm going to attack. Okay, so I'll attack Carlos with Sliver Legion. For 11? Uh, yes, for Ooh. 11. Commander damage. Commander first damage strike, and commander first damage. strike. Oh, yes. And if it takes damage, somehow. Somehow, yeah. Somehow. If, you, if you make your stuff indestructible yeah. or something. And then... I'll attack Spiteful Sliver, that's a 6-6. Six, six. Uh, Jordan. I like blockers, so I'll just attack with those. Yeah, well, uh, like I said, Turn 7 <laughs> Noble Hierarch does have a purpose. Uh, block. Any All right. I think I take 11 commander damage. Oh, dang. No, I, I can't mean, do I'm that. I'm okay with that. I can't. Well, oh my goodness. <laughs> Yeah, See, you had to get all cute with Seize the Day. You're all tapped out. You can't use your <laughs> well, acrobatics every turn. Well, that was commander damage, turn. too. So. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's fair. All right. All right. And then I will pass turn because nobody did anything to my slivers. So what do you got? That's the real question. Don't worry. But uh, you would have played it last time. <laughs> no, you tapped out last time. Draw for mm. turn. How many tapped lands can you draw? On a, who puts this many tapped lands in their deck? <laughs> in an aggro Boros uh, deck. Yeah. I'm gonna be doing so many maneuvers. <laughs> I'll pass the turn. Hey, it draws. Yeah. Right? Uh, yeah, I will. Will. yeah. I'll tap down. Yeah, I'll tap down. Yeah. Guy, no. Galia? Galia? Yeah, Galia. And then I'll untap and draw. If you let her attack next turn, I won't blow up any of your permanents. <laughs> you I'll blow up it. the Sliver Legion cool. if you let me attack. Cool. Yeah. There All we right. Go. Hold on. Not, not that. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna play a land. It's gonna be Rogue's okay. Passage. Oh. Um, man, I really need. Rogue's Passage can work on any creature too. Oh. oh. So if like your Whoa. opponents are attacking the other opponent. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I have to, to say do. that. Yeah. <laughs> that gives me something to do. And then, man, I just pass. All right. Untap. Oh. On your end step, I'm going to acrobatic oh, yeah. remove. Might as well. So. Yeah. On tap, upkeep, drop. Take a peek at my top card. Ah! Play a fabled passage. It's a good fetch sound. A card into play. And then shuffle. <laughs> All right. This excavator's doing work. You yeah. Land. Plus the Corsair. Oh, sweet. There we go. There we go. Not great, but better than nothing. Let's see here. I think we're gonna go for that one first. Um, right off the top, we're gonna cast Sage's Reverie. Oh man, usually that one's amazing. I know. So it does your graveyard too, I think. Draw a card for each R you control, but it's attached to a creature. Oh, never so mind. There's another one like it. Yeah. And then it gets plus one plus one for each R I control that's attached to a creature. <gasps> it doesn't have to be one I control, so I get to draw two yeah, cards. Yeah. And it's plus two plus two on that excavator. Wow. That was a big win. They were both lands. Um, <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um, so we're going to pay 
Another three mana for an intrepid archaeologist. Beginning of combat on my turn, I can attach any number of R's oh. and equipment I control to target permanent or player. Um, oh, so it's... I'm going to go to combat. I'm going to put this ability on the stack. I feel like everyone's going to let it resolve. Uh, I'm going to choose zero as my any number. And then I'm going to attempt to move to declare attackers. All right. I'm going to yep. swing at slivers and yep. I'm going to Argentum armor your commander. All right. An 11, 11 first strike is bigger than my 10, 10. It's, a, so it's not allowed. <laughs> it is. It is bigger. Yeah. Okay. Um, and you're swinging it at me. Yeah. It's also coming at you. Cause... Okay. So I'll block with my, uh, sliver token. Okay. Which is a one, one. Yeah. Um, first strike, haha. -ha. <laughs> <laughs> and, <laughs> and then it'll take and then 10. It'll take 10, and, and so will you. Yay! Does it have to be me? Can you choose any opponent? <laughs> I could choose any opponent. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, you take 10? Wow. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that sliver. Not yeah. gonna lie. It's, it's like <laughs> really good. I'm sitting right next to you and still forgot about yeah. it. Um, <laughs> Okay, well, that's uh, I think I've punched myself in the face enough for one turn. Go ahead. <laughs> All right. The sliver is the main reason I run Blasphemous Act. I'm not going to uh, lie. I will untap, yeah. upkeep, draw. Oh, no. Pretty what? good. <laughs> <laughs> the um, game's going to be over. <laughs> yeah. This is crazy, but I'm passing my turn. I'm playing a draw. Um, sorry. Go sorry. Sliver. Oh, end of, your end turn, of my I'm gonna turn. Blink. Oh, flicker. Sure, sure, yeah. That's all. And then end of this turn, I'll blink. Yup, yup. Oh my gosh. I'm playing Drago Slivers. <laughs> Did you find your other tapped lands? I got two <laughs> lands and I got a, I got a non-land, I guess. One non-land. Draw for turn. Oh, okay, that's a land. I have four lands in hand. It's really nice. Um, at least let me play this ta untapped this time. Fury, Calm, Snarl. I'll reveal a mountain. <laughs> Yay! Yeah. Oh, I gain nine life. Every time I cast that white spell, I gain three life. Cool. You're right. Unfortunately, I think I have to pass. Yeah. Okay, I'll uh, tap down your first liver. Or, or sorry, first strike sliver. <sighs> Untap, draw. Okay, I'm going to cast Seram. Oh, yeah. Cast Mantle of the Ancients on What's Kilia. That do? So this one, it says... You have that one, too. Enchant a creature you control. Uh, when it enters the battlefield, return any number of target aura or equipment cards from your graveyard to the battlefield attached to the creature. Whoa. And then it gets a plus one, plus one for each aura and equipment attached to it. Whoa. Okay. But are you going to pay two white? You got to... What's that? You still have to pay double white. I pay... Yeah, so one, two, three. So you lose a life? What's that? You lose a life, then? Uh, oh, sorry. Yes. Thank you. Yay! Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, I just got to get that one more point of damage before we all get slaughtered by no, this. Oh, that's good. That's good. Uh, so then I'll equip that. And then the only one I get back is Inner Demon. Oh, that was it? It's huh. not so bad. So all creatures, all non-demon creatures get minus two, minus two. Oh. oh. And then he'll get a plus two, plus two. And then I'll draw a card off of SRAM. And I'll play my land for turn. Oh, man. Oh, man. And then I'll go to combat. I will swing... I think our life just died. Oh, oh shoot. It's a good, nice, middle of the road number. Carlos, I'll swing at you. Those don't buff its power. Those don't buff its power. So it gets a plus one, plus one for each, for each of these. The creature gets plus one, plus one for each R I attached to it. So it counts itself. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So double nine. Double lifelink. Nine double lifelink. Bang. Oh, and you're just taking it? He can't block. I know, but you have like a million <laughs> mana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then Carlos, that's a 13. I've taken 11 commander damage and nine commander damage. 13. Okay, I hit oh, you, you hit me for four. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I have to try and kill you now. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Did you have anything so, at end of turn? Oh yeah, I'm gonna acrobatic maneuver. Untap, keep, draw, draw, take a peek. I should have done that in response, actually. We're gonna pay five. We're gonna treachery the sliver. Claim. Yeah, there it is. Right. <laughs> Unless on. you play auras from the top, and you can steal other people's stuff. Uh, Any response? Um, 
I'm really sad if if that's that counts right. as a response. <laughs> not, you're not gonna take his commander. And then look at the top. Ooh, and you can blink your stuff. So yeah, I've got no good targets, but I want to get these off the top of my library. So I'm gonna transform this Liver Queen to a three-three with no ability, so I can draw a card. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> you get it. You could at least make him pay too much. Oh, guess. no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I, mean, I had a way yeah. out. <laughs> <laughs> it's gone. Oh, and guess what? I didn't even need a card. I've got eight of them. Oh. <laughs> All right. And then the chain stopped. So we're going to oh. start it up again. Crack up. Actually, we're not going to cast Fabled Passage because I would have to discard anyway. So we're going to cast Misty and pay a life to try to avoid discarding. And then peek at that. Pay six. <laughs> yeah, so much land. We're going to put a oh. Lox on Warhammer on that. And we're going to send wing both of them at... Uh, both of them and me? Yeah. Until... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Swing at you for 19. Holy mother. Uh, trigger wow. the Argentum armor. We're going to start blowing uh, up Dilla's land so we won't be what? in phase. Oh, <laughs> We're going to blow up your silver <laughs> encampment. I will activate it in response. I only need to pay one. And I'm going to uh, price of fame. It costs ah, two no! less if it targets a legendary creature. And yeah. then it also costs one or two less. So it's one black. Destroy target creature. Wow. That's what I oh, get no, no, for no. attacking you. I knew I shouldn't have. <laughs> and then I'll surveil and then I'll surveil two and Silver Quill will get destroyed. Okay. And I'll surveil yeah. Surveil two. So surveil. Although it was painful, two. it was the right choice. Then put any right, number yeah. of them into my graveyard. Right Gotta divide your threats. In any yeah. order. At least I didn't put it on this stupid elk. <laughs> okay, okay. It's not that stupid. <laughs> oh. I mean <laughs> it's the saddest oh, silver yeah. queen. <laughs> it is. <laughs> One mana short of reattaching the Argentum armor. you take nine, though, Dylan? Yeah, you yeah. go down to 36. I did one good thing today. No one else <laughs> is gaining life. Right? And I then, know. Uh, I guess we'll <laughs> pass the turn. End of turn, I'll acrobatic maneuver again. Gain some life. Draw a card. My Pasco sliver strategy is not going very well. <laughs> 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 because it's my turn, and I didn't tap anything. <laughs> So I'll draw, <laughs> only draw. I'm gonna play a Sliver Hive <laughs> as my land for a turn. Now Drago slivers is online. Now, yeah, now if Drago only works. The Sliver deck control the Sliver. <laughs> we don't need to think about that. <laughs> 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 um, right, hey, you can run, cast your commander. Yeah, run your I commander could, back out there. I could, but also prison term is out. I think I'm just. Pasco, go ahead. A little acrobatic maneuver. Draw a card. I need some life gain. <laughs> There's life gain slivers. Draw in for there. turn. Yeah, sure. There are. <laughs> but I need them. Yeah. <laughs> card draws, what you need. Oh, certainly. Sphinx is red. Blue sun. Let's play a fabled passage. Melody. Crack it. There we go. I mean, distant melody wouldn't do too much. Not currently, but yeah. You know, in a better slivers deck, it would do something. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm gonna cast uh, Hero Bladehold. You can see it's a three-four battle cry. And when it attacks, I can put two one-one white soldier creature tokens to, onto the bail, battlefield tapped and attacking. Oh, okay. It is a white spell, so gain some more life and. I will Slayer Stronghold it though. So it gets haste and vigilance and plus two plus zero. I will send, I don't, I think I just have to go at Dylan with everything. Because <laughs> <laughs> I die to it. I just die to Dylan. Yeah. Dylan the team. will attack you for um, a bunch of damage. Okay. So I get two soldiers. Does battle cry not? It doesn't pump them this time, right? It does. It does. Other because you can stack it. Creatures get plus one plus zero, right? Yeah, and then you control ball yeah. so you can stack it. So they'll come in. Battle cry will pump everybody. They're all already two twos. So um, so the total damage is 18, 21 damage. Dang! Wow! Doesn't mess around. Now I just feel guilty for attacking you. I'm so I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> 21. It's all good. I and how much commander damage have you taken? So Is that the first deal? time? No, no, no. How much did he deal this turn? Uh, six. So I'm at 14. I could do six more commander damage. Mm -hmm. You put me at 20. 
Should I kill you? Up to you. Are you <laughs> gonna kill me? I have no hand. You could kill me with one oh, swing, sure. though. Yeah, yeah. But if, so if it's a bargain, I guess I take it because I'm dead <laughs> otherwise, right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's basically what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you, I have if, no choice. If you're gonna point. kill me, then I, I have to kill you. Right? Yeah. So I can't. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Uh, yeah, we'll say this. You don't do anything to me or my per permanence for one round. Okay. Uh, I'll go to my second main phase. Either way, I'll p but I'll pay three total and play Krenko Tin Street Kingpin. This one is the one that says when he attacks, put a plus one plus one counter on it. Then create a number of one one red goblin creature tokens equal to Krenko's power. Are you popping for three? I think I have to send it your way. Kay. Three damage your way. It's the last time I remind you of a trigger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, should, you probably should have. Um, that puts me down to seven, so I will pass the turn. Untap. Upkeep, draw. Cast Sun Titan. Ooh. Ooh. Um, I'll put an Agent of Fate. Oh, man. Yep. And then I think that I'll just pa pass. Untap, upkeep, draw. We're going to pay eight to cast my commander again. Look at the top uh. card of my library anytime <laughs> I want. Oh. <laughs> Play a Hall of Heliods. <laughs> Generosity. Ooh, nice. See, puts it on top. Oh, oh my god. Whatever I <laughs> That's want good. on top. I also have the artifact one in there. Gonna yeah, go the grab Academy an Runes. Ancestral yeah, Academy mask. Runes. And then we're going to look at the top card oh, of my shoot. library. <laughs> I'm going to cast it on my Ravenup Excavator. Nice. <laughs> so I've got one. Two, three, four. Plus your enchantments count. Yeah, one, Five. two, three, four. <laughs> four. So eight. So plus sixteen, plus sixteen. Oh, nice. With trample this time. Cool, yeah. Nice. And I, we are coming at Carlos. Let's see what happens. Okay. So it's sixteen plus four. So twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. And almost as big on the back half. It's a 25, 23. All right. I'm going to pay three. Oh, don't make me sack an attack. I'm going to generous gift your guy. Oh, oh, no. I get an elephant, though? Yeah. You do. Sweet <laughs> trade. <laughs> and <laughs> 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 Always wanted an elephant. <laughs> you, I didn't want to have to do that, right? I was going to save Wait. it for Killian. Okay. That's it. Go ahead. Okay, I have no end step shenanigans. <laughs> so oh, no. Can't you make a sliver? No, nope. I don't control, control a sliver. A sliver. Oh, oh, it's so sad. Oh, oh, okay, so I'll drop for my turn. <laughs> <laughs> I know, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I will cast Sliver Legion. There we go. Saddest Sliver Legion ever. <laughs> yeah, it would be sadder if you did prison term on it. I'm reminding you of your trigger. Please don't do it. Yeah, I'm going to save it for later. Okay. We'll put it on the next thing Carlos plays. I'm cool with that. And I will pass with my 7-7. Seven, seven. I'll draw for your turn. I'll play a mountain. Paying 5 for Mirror Wing Dragon. What's that one do? Uh, when a player casts an instant or sorcery that targets only Mirror Wing Dragon, that player may copy that spell for each other creature he or she controls. Oh my gosh. That, that spell could target... Each copy targets a different one of those creatures. What? Wow, that's sweet. Um, and I'll deal three damage to, hey, I'll deal three to you, Dylan. I will attack. Friendly reminder, you can send the soldiers wherever you want. The new ones? Yeah. It's true. Yeah, just throw them right at Brock. Uh, <laughs> or someone else. Someone else is also a valid target. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not target. I'll attack with these guys, and I will send them at Jordan. All right. So before any blocks, I'll trigger, let's first trigger Hero of Blade. Let's stack it so that... Uh, you make your dudes, then you battle I'll make cry. the dudes. I'll make the dudes. No, wait. Krenkos aren't tapped in attacking, though, right? They're just in play. Yeah, I think Yeah, I think I make the dudes, I battle cry, then I make dudes. Um, it'll be one extra dude because of the battle cry. Oh, yeah, it's equal to his power. Yeah. Ooh, that's a synergy. Uh, he puts a counter on himself. Oh, three You're gobbles. Four gobbles. It's a counter, so it'll be a two, and then it gets one battle cry. So and three. Then he's oh, there's a four. Creature. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. Where's that Blasphemous Act, anyway? 
that's, <laughs> that, the, that's the question. <laughs> um, yeah, they're not attacking. Um, they have two more soldiers. And, okay. So the total is a 4-5. Four, and we have a 4-4 four, four, and 4 three twos. All right. We're going to double block the hero blade hold. Double blocking with the 3-3. Three, three. And the 3-3. Three, three. Oh, that can't block right now, right? Oh, it's got present term on it. Why did I not move it? Ah! Can you move it on right. to the goblin? Just... If I you could... will, you can put it on a oh. goblin or something. Okay, yeah. We'll put it on the like, goblin. Yeah, there we go. Now we're double blocking. So then at least if you blink it, you lose your token. Not that that's going to stop you from blinking out the prison term. So I'll be taking 8 plus 4, right? So but sorry, 12. you're uh, blocking with oh, how much six. damage? Six six. Yeah, there's a three three and a three three. There's an elk an and elk an elephant, elephant teaming up. Got a zoo over here. <laughs> that elk used to be a queen. <laughs> <laughs> I think I do. <laughs> Cloud shifter. Oh my gosh! There's oh, more blinking wow. going on so. than ever before. Okay. So she'll blink in, um, and then yeah. Did oh. you count the rest of the damage? Yeah, it's 12, right? Uh, th four. Oh, no, that's 12. Three each, so 12 plus, plus 16. Yeah. I think that's all for me. So I, well, I think I can play my talisman now. Let's play one, two. I paid two for talisman, and I am done. Oh, sorry, I'll gain three life. Don't worry, bro. I'm still going to kill every sliver I see. <laughs> I know. I'm just gonna, I'm just I feel like right that was now. also implied. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm just gonna pass for right now. All right, untap. Do not want to have to pay commander tax ever again. <laughs> Draw a stupid sorcery. Another sorcery, and it's so good. Man, this is so bad for Brock, but whatever. Um, <laughs> are, you, are you killing my Sliver Legion? <laughs> it, might, it might be. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, you know, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> yeah. All right, so then we'll look at the top and we'll play this. Boom, so we can draw some cards. Uh, for each aura I control that's attached to a creature. So we got one, two, three, four. So I'll draw four. And then, yep, four playing. Winds of Wrath. My hey. Hey. With no, with no enchantments on them. I, my goblin lives. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah. Oh, so any of your... Ah, oh, Killian's still alive. Killian's still here. Yeah. All right, I will respond with a acrobatic maneuver just to draw a trillion cards. Uh, does yeah. it, is it immediate blink? It's not until yeah. end of yeah, turn? Oh, okay. Blink. I thought you were going to save all your no. <laughs> I was like, no! no. <laughs> I don't think that's... Um, I will right. gain three lives. The elephant's gone, though. Let's see. Oh, thank God. I was so really worried, worried about elephant. that. Yeah, Sun yeah. and Agent are both gone. Um, I'm going to draw 10, not 11, 12, 13 cards. Oh, your goblin dies. <laughs> 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 oh, no. All right. We're gonna peek at the top. Oh, top two cards in my library. Apparently, <laughs> my bad. All right. Oh, uh, oh. I'm still responding to your. Oh man. Your spell. Okay. Well, I'm gonna be tapped out, but um, I will now pay four and do. So this actually comes back. I'm gonna do semester's end on the Strixhaven theme here. Yeah, Exile yeah. Exile any number of target creatures and or player planeswalkers you control. <laughs> and or players. At the beginning of the next end step, return each of them to the battlefield <sighs> under its owner's control. Each of them enters the battlefield with an additional plus one plus one counter on it if it's a creature. A loyalty if it's planeswalker. You found the save? I did it. <laughs> got it. <laughs> Saving these guys. Sorry, tokens. All right. <laughs> hey, you want to do that for my Sliver Legion? <laughs> yeah. Well... Man tower, and then I guess we're just gonna put the warhammer on this and try and get some damage over it. Carlos. Yeah, it's commander yeah. damage though. Yeah. Yeah. It's One, really bad. Two, three, and then four, seven, so ten. It's just ten. But that's the first time I've taken it, right? Yes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I actually gained three from that semester's end. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, and that's it. All right, Brock. Okay. Come back, boys. Let's Brr. see what happens. Come on, Brock. All right, let's see if I top deck the best card in my deck. It's shockingly, like, not bad. 
Dylan just wants you to play four, it. Phase. Five, <laughs> six. I'll pay seven for Morophon. Oh, the Boundless. There you go. Okay. If it enters, um, when it enters, I'll choose Sliver, believe it or not. Yeah. Sliver Hive active. Sliver Hive is active. And then I'll pay a white from my trial for Sinew Sliver. Nice. So all slivers get plus one, plus one. Yay. The pumper. Including other nice. peoples, but that's not a sliver, so who, who cares? It is an elk. <laughs> it is an elk. And then after that, I will pass my turn. All right. I lived. That means we all die. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. I'm going to just have a quarter of I do feel like I need to do something. This do, 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 all right. Draw for turn. Do, do. Let's play a spectator seating. Let's land for turn. All right. I'm going to cast... Inax and Symed. Plus one, plus one when he gets targeted. Yeah, it's a uh, three, two, first strike vigilance. It has heroic. Whenever I cast a spell that targets it, uh, creatures I control get plus one, plus one, and trample until end of turn. Ooh. Um, I'm going to gain three. I'll deal three damage to you or face. Yep. And then I think at this point I give the hero vigilance and plus two plus zero till end of turn. The hero gets uh, with Slayer Strongholds. Now I will expedite Inax. So I'll draw a card. This will come back later. Um, it gets haste and all my creatures get plus one plus one and trample till end of turn. So now I will attack with everything. So this is Vigilance. These are not. I'm um, sorry, three damage to your face with the uh, Expedite. Of all the turns to tap out, Brock. I know, <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, I'll make five goblins and I get two soldiers. I'm sending Feather over here. Okay. I'm sending Mirrorwing over there. And I think everything else is going at Dylan, but let me double check. 11, 12, base power damage, plus battle cry is five, so 17, plus this plus is another five, so 22. So I'm at least, and so that, if I deal you 22, you gain 18, I'm doing you four, basically. So yeah. I think so it's enough to be worth base it. Base power 12, plus six, plus six, so 24, and so the 22. Yeah, but does your life gain matter if, like, you're dead kind of a thing? Is that what you're saying? So the, so the second one doesn't. The exactly. One does. So how much will you gain on the first one? Nine. Nine. I'll go to 18 and die. So I think you'll die before oh. the second one resolves? Because it's a trigger. Ah, okay. Yep. I didn't know that. It's not a state-based effect. Yeah. There we go. Okay. I'm good. I so have no response. It's just feather at me? I'm just the mirror wing at me? Yes, before before damage, though. Oh, no! Um, I'm in a psychotic fury on feather. So target multicolor creature gains double strike until end of turn. Draw a card. Okay. And I'll deal three damage to your face. Okay. And draw a card. So now it is 14 commander damage. 14, and I had six before. Yep. So I'm at 20 commander damage. Suck. I'm alive by one. Um, I will also, I'm going to accelerate the uh, Annex and Siamede. Give him haste. Okay, yeah. And then well, I'll do you three me. more damage. Combat damage. Four, five, six, seven, eight. And then uh, second main phase. But I think I can just seize the day on Feather. Oh, yeah. Got four for seize the day. I take a damage. Crack in with the flyer. Yeah. Game over. I'll attack you with Feather. Boom. That's sweet. This was a really fun game, and it did feel like everyone was able to do what their deck wanted to, except for Brock, because when Slivers do what they want to, it's the end of the game. We're all dead. I personally had not been in my local game store to actually play any games for almost two years, so this was super cathartic, and I'm excited to be able to go back and really support and, and have that fun feeling again. The next time you're buying singles online, consider checking out Game Grid Lehigh. Again, if you use our link, you're supporting us as well as our local game store, and that really means a lot to us. Either way, thanks so much for watching, and keep it nerdy.